Alexander Usyk defeats and drops Tyson Fury via split decision. Look, the fight itself, what happened, how it played out was shocking itself. But what's more shocking is that Usyk actually got awarded the decision. I was like pleasantly shocked. I'm not going to lie. I wasn't surprised. I was more than surprised. I was shocked. I was dumbfounded that they actually gave Usyk the decision. He obviously deserves it. I thought Usyk won that fight, clearly. But I would never think they would give that close of a fight to Usyk and not to Fury. If I'm Usyk, I retire. I just won. I retire. Fuck it. I'm only getting older. I retire. Fuck it. I'm not, let me just break down the fight right now. And then we'll speak about Usyk and the judges and everything. Round one starts. Uh, Usyk more active. Round two starts. Uh, I think, was it in the beginning of round two? Was it the end of round one or round two? I don't remember now. Either one of them, Usyk hurt Fury. Fury, And Fury then got a bloody nose. He busted the nose of Fury badly. But then from rounds three, four, five, six, seven, Fury got in a groove. Fury started landing that right uppercut at will. His jab was busting Usyk's head. He was landing body shots that seemed to bother Usyk badly. And Usyk rounds five... He seemed to be breathing with his mouth open. He seemed to be tired. Round six, it was a bad round for Usyk as well. Round seven, Usyk was hurt with a right uppercut. And it seemed like round eight, Usyk went out extremely aggressive. It seemed like it was more the, uh, his last hurrah. He just wants to do one more. Like he wants to just try before he, getting knocked out. And I was about to be like, I was thinking, why doesn't Usyk just run? Just to avoid being knocked out. So it looks better on the resume. It looks better on the record. But he hurt Fury in the latter round of round eight. Round nine starts. Fury uh, is beginning to tire himself from all the work he did earlier in the round. And the last 30 seconds, last 40 seconds of round nine, Usyk basically knocks Fury out, out, out on his feet. And, that, and the referee didn't do anything. Like uh, Fury goes on the ropes. Referee didn't count his knock down anything. And then Usyk just started wailing punch after punch on Fury. Uh, until he went down, the referee came in. Uh, he gave him count. It was the real end of round nine. Round, round ten starts, and uh, in the beginning of round ten, you could tell Fury is still extremely hurt, but Usyk was looked extremely tired. He didn't have the energy to, uh, to finish him off after that rally. But Usyk controlled rounds ten, eleven, and twelve uh, fairly clearly, and I had him winning that fight one fifteen and one twelve. And one of the judges also gave it to him 115, 112. Other judge gave it to him 114, 113. One judge gave it to Fury 114, 113. Look, I'm not mad at both of those scorecards. I thought Usyk won. But uh, I could give... Uh, you could say I, could, I gave him round two. I could give round two to Fury. So I'm not mad at the 114, 113. And it was a really close fight. And I think the... Not I think. It's, it's obvious. The knockdown is what split it in Usyk's favor. On the judges, and Usyk is now the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. He's the first person ever to to become undisputed four belt champion in the heavyweight division, and he was also the first person ever to do to get the undisputed four belt championship of the cruiserweight division. So he's done lots of history. Alexander Usyk has cemented himself. I'm gonna have to say it like it is: is a top ten heavyweight boxer of all time, and so far. For guys that have had their primes in the 21st century, he's the best fighter in the 21st century. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. I think his accomplishments reign higher than Canelo's main, whether it's Andre Wards, Kels, uh, Joe Calzaghe, those guys. I think he, Vladimir Klitschko, Vitaly Klitschko. I think what Usyk has done, he surpassed all those other fighters, in my opinion. Now, that's my thoughts. Give me your thoughts, comment section below. Like, subscribe, to the video. And what do you think about the fight? Did you guys think Fury won the fight? Let me know. And Sadiq Boxing out.